In this afternoon's Bright Spot, an artist who began losing his sight as a child has found a unique way now to showcase his talent. Across the pond in Britain, he's actually using Braille to break down barriers. Channel 3's Ian Lee reports from London. Clark Reynolds knows his way around an art gallery, but this is the first time the blind artist is displaying his own work. Dots for people with low vision. His Power of Touch exhibit in London features a color-coded braille system using raised dots that visitors touch to decode messages. Being able to touch it is really nice because you're so used to going to galleries and it's like don't touch anything. But it's not just for those with vision impairment, it's for everybody, sighted, unsighted. Hi, I'm in Red, yeah? Reynolds was just six years old when he lost sight in his right eye, and over the years, he lost the rest. When I learned Braille uh, three years ago, it was like, how can I make it accessible for everyone? He's hoping to bring Braille into school curriculums and change perceptions of art while breaking down stereotypes about the visually impaired. There, there's obviously many uh, blind artists you know, in the world, um, but of course, how many of those are being able to, to be given a voice and to be recognized um, as a standalone artist? For the viewer to step into my shoes, please look. Reynolds encourages art lovers to try on special glasses to see what it's like to struggle with sight. Identified by touch. Proving in some cases, art is in the hand of the beholder. Ian Lee, CBS News, London.